Hello, boys and girls. My name is Hot Stand. We are back in Oxygen Not Included. Last time, uh, we got our rocket upgraded um, to a petroleum and uh, oxalite. Uh, and today, uh, I think we will have to turn our attention on stabilizing our colony because currently let's head over here where it's a bit quieter um, we only have actually we have some duplicates the seven uh, sitting in the rocket and we are pretty stable with the calories but we cannot add more duplicates so maybe we have to look into how we can get more food out of uh, of this this cold rock here and at the same time i think we will continue uh, launching rockets so we can get um, research um, data banks um, to research uh, because the goal really is to complete the research and what we really want to have of course is uh, it's this new fancy engine here but we need the cargo bay so we can get out of space materials uh, so I think it's realistic in this episode that we can do the research uh, but I don't see it feasible that we will have either this upgrade or or that one so one thing at a time and thinking about food uh, one thing that we can do is basically uh, having uh, uh, a wool farm and wolves can basically bury through everything what they cannot get through is steel so let's build something like this. And then we also want to have a steel door. And of course we have run out of steel. And the shovels they will eat sand or actually regolith which we have in abundance up here so we can feed that to them um, but ah, we are lacking the lime uh, but anyway let's queue up a bit more steel we need way more steel so uh, <coughs> here is where i plant this one out so what we need in here is a feeder station um, also want to have a zooming station and then as the uh, shovels they will uh, basically turn um, what they eat into solid blocks so we can't have that so Let's let's place a robo miner here, uh, which will solve that issue for us. 
and uh, we need a bit of um, power for that uh, we can place a transformer up here and then connect this like that and have this go over here right that's one farm that we can build and then another thing that comes to mind is uh, let's just have a look at plants that we have um, we already have a bristle blossom farm and actually there is a bit of uh, of a problem here you can see some of the plants are stifled sti stifled halted in their growth because it actually has gotten too warm and the reason for that is we had this rail going through here um, with the with the hot uh, copper and that was just too much so what i did is basically go down here and then not through the, the farming plots but basically through here and that already helps a bit yes lime that's that's what we need so back to here uh, dust cap um we need slime we do have a bit of slime we do not have huge amounts but uh, let's let's have a small farm for that it's one option um then excellent that's not something that we can farm um pinch of pepper nuts um they need polluted water. We do not have too much polluted water, and uh, they need quite a bit of temperature. I think we are not there uh, with with the temperatures in our base, um, and we have uh, water seeds. Uh, and I think there we need to feed them uh, bleach stone uh, something that we also don't have um, there is a way um, to get bleach stone that through uh, uh, a kind of, uh, of uh, pufflets um, uh, that's uh, that's a bit on the uh, difficult side so mm, here we also have a bit of, uh, of temperature issue um, so looking at, at this up here we are above 50 degrees so that would actually actually work so if we build a ladder uh, up here and then let's let's for once do a proper farm so we have this here and then we have the farming station is it in here no is it in here no is it in refinement no is it in utilities? No. Have I missed it? Yes. So, there 
there. That's it. Um, we can have this basically like that. Cancel everything with this excess. And Them one, one plot lower. Because what we need here is atmosphere, um, water, salt water, or uh, brine, uh, and they actually consume a bit of uh, of salt water. Uh, so maybe we should. The other kind of plot, this one. And then pipe. This liquid pipe and have a bridge there and bridge there and then something like this. Side. And here on that side, we can just build a line for now. Okay, that's that's the problem for all the fleeing. Um. Probably we also should dig out here. So seeing that we do have uh, the the warms or the, the the heat up here, uh, I think we can at least have try and have. Um, few of these uh, pinch of peppermint plant um, here we have also normal tile Yeah. 
Dick ever sing out? All right, I think that's something they need to do. Um, why did I disable that? That's, that's not what I wanted. Uh, and up here we need a uh, steel door. Uh, still don't have it. Uh, we can set up this to um, shovel. Um, we probably also need the shovel. Then we should be pretty good up here. And shovels usually are a good source of food because one shovel uh, will give us uh, quite a bit of uh, of meat. So hmm, I think I have to turn this one on as well for the whole setup to work. Otherwise, we will not get enough uh, um, oxalite for our tank. But I think uh, that's enough work queued up for the duplicants. So let's let them do the work and then we will see where we stand. Hopefully, uh, in due time, we see the calories go up so we can add uh, another duplicate. Right. The shuffle form is all done, but I noticed I don't currently have any shovels to shove in there. So that will sit empty for a while until we can get across some. And then down here, the two forms are also complete. So we can actually start planting in here. And then in here, of course, we will have this one. And what we are still lacking is uh, uh, basically a uh, mushroom form. here a bit and have a door here mm. probably we want to have a door that lets air or in this case carbon dioxide through um, progress here and of course on here we need um, uh, bleach zone so this farm will work as long as we have bleach zone uh, here this farm um, as long as we have phosphorite should not be a problem because the drag plates produce phosphorite uh, we probably will run out of uh, pollute water first. But we will see. And this should um, 
enhance our our capabilities quite a bit because now here you can see um, we are too warm all through the band there so it's a good thing that we figured something out another thing that we can do is we can actually have a few refrigerators there. Um, and we probably want to hook that up on the middle line there. Um, because that one is not yet so uh, overpowered. Right? Because then we also can avoid um, food going bad, which is a waste of food. So. Okay, and here we are good, we uh, need this wall, and here we can plant those, and as we are not requiring any liquid for that, we are using normal plant planting plots here, and of course all through here, and basically the same principle uh, applies here as well. This will uh, work as long as we have slime to feed them. On the research front, we are still not yet done there. Uh, we have our rocket back. Uh, actually, we could uh, start it again. So let's set this up then. And with this rocket, we only can get out to the 2000 uh, kilometer mark. So only up to here. Um, Otherwise, we would need more petroleum. We would have to rework the rocket um, for asteroids that we have already visited. We will we will get a tiny bit of uh, research data back, but not as much as uh, as for the first. But that's more all. Okay, it takes longer until we are done here. Um, but at least in the moment, we are dealing uh, with these kind of, uh, of issues and I think we are on the right track there. So seeing that, let's close this episode for today and next time we will probably still be focusing on improving our colony uh, before we get back to uh, outer space exploration properly. So hope you enjoyed this one and tune in for the next. So goodbye.